So I'm at my local pawn shop, my favorite shop in the basement, trying to work out a deal on basically all the systems. Cords, controllers, just overflow, untested. So we'll see what happens. He's in the 1250 range. I'm in the 750 range because there's a lot of risk, a lot of work, but we'll see what happens. Games, games, games. I got done at around 11.30. Okay. So yeah, I was in here for well, I appreciate you doing that. I was in here for an hour and a half just back <laughs> everything, trying to figure out what I'm trying to get best prices for everything. Okay. Um, it's like, what's a number you're comfortable with? What The number that I gave you, what's a number that's comfortable for you in a sense? Um, uh, that's what, that's the numbers without the PS1s and then a, mm -hmm. the Wii's, I believe, and then there's, I think that was it, right? Yes. So, so yeah, considering condition, like if I, I am comfortable and I have cash, I don't know if that helps. <laughs> yes, it does. Okay. I, I'm not gonna lie to you on that. I, I brought I brought enough cash to make something happen, but I'm probably in the seven fifty eight hundred range. Okay. To be. And you know if we need to get to a thousand, if we can throw in some wees, if we can throw in some extras, and kind of make it work. Just because, you know, I'm looking like right there, yep. that controller's no good. It's frayed. You know, loose sticks on a lot of them. This one's nice. It's pretty tight. A lot of the, the, the neon ones like that are the best ones that we have. Yeah. Here. Yep. Um, yeah, it's these, uh, they're, it's from the Fantastic series. That's what they're called. The yeah, yeah, yeah. I've zone green, the fire gray, orange. The gray, the gray one, too, the smoke or, or yeah, gray smoke one. Smoke gray, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like these colored ones, like these, I believe it was, or it's a different color. This like is that. atomic purple, but there's okay. there's a smoke gray that does look like it. It's just, yeah. it's transparent gray. Okay. I've right. got all, um, all those in my collection at home. <laughs> so... The other thing I have to consider is some of these N64s without jumpers. Yep. Those most likely don't work. Which I did see at least one expansion I think pack in a here. There's couple in here, I believe. Okay. Yep. Um, like this is yep, an expansion. Yep. But that's just a bad sign because if somebody doesn't have one of those in there, it's probably already parted. Well, these were all pulled out by the owner. Okay. Every one of them. Every one of them was pulled out by him, blah, blah, blah. I don't know what literally happened out here. Okay. This happened a while ago. Gotcha. Like a while ago. If there's anything good in here. It's a lot of extra CDs too. Yeah. Oh my gosh, these are all full. Yeah, all of them are filled with the oh. There used to be a, a website that would buy them, yep. but they literally just stopped. Yeah, they did. It sucks because I was gonna do that too. Were you really? <laughs> Man. I was gonna. I was trying to try to just get rid of all this stuff down here because this is literally just sitting. Yeah. It's been sitting for years. Yeah, yeah, and it might sucks. as well have something opposed to nothing. 
And that's the thing with you guys, you're getting new stuff every day, so if you can I have... I get new stuff every single day, and I get a lot of it. Yeah. And I try to, like, you know, post uh, or have it out there, but there's so much old stuff that I can't. Yeah. I'm trying to get rid of the old stuff and put in the new stuff, but then it's mm -hmm. just filling up with old stuff because I'm bringing stuff from down here up there trying to get okay. some stuff sold. Yep. You know, but a lot of these game systems, it was just a hit or miss for me. Yeah. I almost brought a bunch of tubs in the van. <laughs> Did you? I almost did, but I just, I'm just going to leave. Are there GameCube power supplies somewhere? Um, not they're all up there, right above you, right above your head. There's not a, a lot. There's only like a couple I found. Oh, okay. And I really, I, yeah, I couldn't find more than that. that okay, was, uh, yeah. If I didn't find them, I was like, where are they at? But I guess somebody got rid of them that I didn't know about. Gotcha. Um. Yeah, I mean, I'm seeing like, there's a tub over here that has a couple random things in it. Looks. Oh, game wise. Yeah. Okay. So I mean, we, that might be worth looking into. All right. So I'm down here by myself now. What we kind of came up with was I can go through and stack some stuff in boxes and bins, and then we'll work it out from there. Uh, he's thinking that he wants to keep some um, to keep the, the owner happy, to keep a little bit of an inventory. Um, so he said just to go through, pick and choose ones that I want more um, and leave ones I'm not too sure about and we'll work it out. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm sure it's going to take a while because there's a lot. And obviously I'll keep you guys posted. I've got the first bin done and I'm kind of taking notes of what's in each bin as I go to make it easier for them as I'm going to check out. The N64s, I'm going to leave some, basically ones that don't have jumpers in them. I'm thinking maybe they've already been parted, like these don't work. So I'll probably leave the ones that don't have jumper packs, take the ones that do. And then for controllers and stuff like that, like this one I'll leave behind because it's got a frayed cord and a terribly loose stick. Um, third party stuff I might leave behind, though I don't think they would charge me very much. But I also kind of found a stack of decent games and such that might help. So we're making it happen. So I think I'm going to take those nine. Uh, added there was an expansion pack in one of the boxes, so added that to that one. And then I'm going to leave these three. Just kind of leave them a little bit of inventory. They'll have to get jumper packs for those and such, but they might have them in one of these boxes somewhere. So we'll see. I already know I'm going to want that GameCube GBA link cable. So those two boxes are completed. Now I'm going to put some stuff in this clear bin. I'll show you the games, which were just kind of stacked over there. Doesn't know the story on them, but all these are in there. Just games that aren't worthless in most cases. Some nice ones. So Ready to Rumble on Dreamcast, Scarface. That's probably the best of the bunch. It is complete. Zelda Collector's Edition. Real Monsters. Harvest Moon don't know what this is but it looks interesting music cartridge for PSR 530 only Yamaha who knows Road Rash decent one here Grand Stream Saga we got Starblade on the 3DO which is awesome Dreamcast Tony Hawks Virtual Cop on Saturn a Gex on the 3DO Star Wars Phantom Menace, Crash Warped, Metal Gear Solid, and then a Turbo Graphics game, Alien Crush. 
and figured this wouldn't hurt. X Wing Star Wars PC. So these are some of the best parts. We got four Sega Saturns. The Jungle Green N64. The GameCubes with cords are nice. And then these are the PS1s with AV out, a whole stack of them. So, pretty nice. This is what I'm leaving behind so far. Condition issues that aren't really fixable. And then we'll see what I'm taking from the rest of this stuff. So in that box we got 17 N64 power supplies, 16 are original. Then there's like 12 or so Segas in there, 4 Saturns, and like 8 Genesis. And now I'm going through the Sega controllers and just found this nice Sega Saturn 3D controller. It's a 6 button. Sega Saturn but frayed cord so that probably won't work but still take it for parts. So we're, I'm counting as I go, keeping track of everything. So I'm at 20 controllers in this bin so far with PlayStation 1, including that fight stick, and I just found this 3DO controller, so that's a cool little find. Puts it at 21 controllers in that box, and I'm kind of going through this one. Lots of third party, which I'm putting into these ones, but still a lot to go. This is going to be quite the buy, hoping to fill the van. These are always nice to come by. Wave bird receiver. Got a Game Boy Player, NES controller, the little GameCube case is worth something, transfer packs, controller packs, there's like 8 N64 controllers in there, including a Jungle Green, and then that, I'm kind of doing these as just like 1, 2, 3, 4, that's what I've added, accessories, that's how I'm noting them, and going through bin by bin, just seeing what's in there, can always use AV cables, one, two, three, and four, those are third party, but they will help. So four accessories, four AV cables. So 10 NES controllers, 2 NES power supplies, 3 original Xbox controllers, and I think I found 3 breakaway cables. The other ones were just third party or in rough shape. And my last box of accessories to go through is this Sega Dreamcast. Controllers is what it says, it's what it looks like too. So I'll go through them and then show you guys what I added. So I just dug in a bin back there and found three of these uh, Game Boy Advance uh, link cables. So there's three of them there. Another N64 transfer pack, one of these wireless adapters, and a PS2 controller. And this Dreamcast thing, so nice little additions. And I'm debating whether to take this PS1. It's super clean, and I'd be getting them cheap. So I might add that to the pile as well. So I've definitely got a lot of stuff. It's been like a couple hours sifting through everything. There's a lot. Hopefully I can get a sweet deal. <laughs> we'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, ton of stuff. All the boxes and stuff I've packed up and kind of noted as I went through what I'm getting. But we'll see how much of a deal they hook me up with gonna be a lot of work but good time to get it I'm filming this on Thursday March like 18th 19th whatever whatever day it is in there so you guys probably know as you're seeing this video it's gotten even crazier I decided to come today because I had a feeling I'm not gonna be able to get much inventory if I don't get it this week so hopefully this will keep me busy for a couple weeks and hold me over This is everything I'm getting so far. Lots and lots of stuff. I still have to go through that bin of games. So, almost finished. This is kind of the stuff I'm leaving. Condition issues. And otherwise just not worthwhile to get into. 
they just look like they wouldn't work and they don't these guys don't know if they work or not third party controller some of the systems are labeled on there that they don't work so I'm obviously leaving those behind but yeah almost finished Okay guys, so I'm filming this actually a couple weeks later. The pawn shop buy is done, accomplished, and it was incredible. So, total spent was $860 cash money. I got so many systems, so many controllers, accessories, even some games as you guys saw. And man, it was a lot of stuff. <laughs> It's been a lot of work. Um, I ended up dropping off a lot of it to David's house so that he could test and clean and, and do stuff there with it. Since he is an independent contractor for me, works when he can. And I have a lot of other stuff to ship out, as you guys have been seeing. Um, so he's gone through and tested most of it. There's still a few things I have to test and kind of clean and go through. There's also been some very surprising items and value of items that I've found. Um, that I didn't even really know about when I was throwing them in the boxes. So I'm going to make another video, a follow-up video, which that one will come out on Monday. So be looking forward to that one, but just know I spent $860 in cash for this pawn shop basement buyout. Um, this was a fun one. This was one of the most fun picks I've had probably ever. And yeah, be sure to look forward to that follow-up video coming out on Monday going to go over in detail, uh, talk about what worked, talk about uh, what didn't work, and I might get into some potential value and stuff, but I'm not sure if we'll get that far. Um, but either way, it's going to be a fun one. So thank you guys for watching this one, and we'll see you guys next time on Monday. Mm -hmm.